chemo session for the last two weeks. It is my choice. It's my life. And I'm going to live what's left of it in whatever way I choose. You've got to do something, Jack. I've got a leech for a mother whose welcome has run out, by the way. I already have. And worst of all, I've got this spiteful, spoiled brat of a daughter who's not only a criminal, oh no, no, she's a tart at all! You only take one to know one! Your dad's been staying with me for a bit. Actually, what when you see a face from the past, is it? No, you had one right! Mum's got cancer. A little loyalty from my nearest and dearest when I'm down on my luck. She's had it for months, and she... She's really, really sick. Is that too much to ask for my baby sister after all these years? Yes. I hope my own father to die. She's got cancer, Dad. She's had it for months. And she stopped having treatment. Do you want the truth? And now you know, now you know everything. Please, please don't go, Dad. I need your help. I'm gonna pay for what I've done and I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die just like he did, but there's gonna be no one here to help me. I'm gonna have to do it, I'm gonna have to do it by myself. Max loves you. He loves you right down to his fingernails. What, so you found out and then you just broke it off with me? Fight this. You go back to the hospital. For your kids, for me, for yourself. Now we have got to pull together and get our boy through this. Yeah, she's gonna do that, Cora. The Brannets together again at last, eh? Yes? Yes? Mm. I'll make sure of it. Come here. Be like old times. Everything's gonna be alright. <laughs>